Welcome to our YouTube channel. In this video, we are going to see how to use the chart in Outlook Online. So for that, we are going to use a uh, desktop Outlook application. So this is my Outlook desktop application. So before getting into the, the reason for using the chart in Outlook Online is data visualization, data clarity, uh, data comparison and for saving the time and uh, data accessibility so let's get started so click on the new email option here so keep the mouse cursor in the insert option and keep the mouse cursor in the body of the email so that the chart option will be visible under the three dots click on those three dots and click on the chart option here so here you can see the variety of chart like recent template line pie bar area map stock surface tree map sunburst, funnel and combo. So based on your requirement, you can use whatever the chart and whatever the information you want to convey into your end user. So based on that, you can use the particular chart. So if I'm clicking on the pie chart here, so this kind of uh, images will be appear in the body of the email. So once I click OK, so now here the pie chart will be appear. So here we can edit our uh, information so here it is mentioned like first quarter 8.2 and second quarter is like 3.2 third 1.4 and fourth 1.2 so if you are taking about the company details or some other details like profit details we can tell about like for september it is uh, profit is like 80 percentage so here we can edit our uh, details in the excel sheet so automatically here by default here also it will be changes so this is how we have to use the chart in the outlook online desktop application so if i if you want to remove the chart click on the right click option and click delete so that the option will be removed the images will be removed so again if we click on this cut option entire thing will be removed so now i want to uh, add any other chart so here i am choosing the surface kind of chart or uh, And click OK. So people who is working in the constructions area, so they will be looking into the surface or the land area or square feet. So based on that, we can choose here. Again, if I want to select any other chart option, so make sure it will be under the insert option. So if I want to see the stock option, like how much is my stock percentage from the last month to this month so here you can see the high is like 55 and low is like 11 here and close is 32 so here you can use it for stock kind of images we can you go for this image uh, particular features in the outlook online so again if i want to delete this So here if I want to use this histogram kind of chart. So click on OK. The histogram uh, image kind of chart will be appear. So we can edit based on our details here. So the changes will be made here also. So I hope you understood this video. For more video like this, subscribe to our YouTube channel and click on the bell icon to get more notification. Thank you.